it's only so long that you can keep poking at a sleeping tiger. And that tiger, she gonna wake up and she gonna tear your behind up. Hold up, what you say about the Filipinas only understanding very little English? Listen to this video, girl. I'm gonna give you a rundown, okay? Filipinas with very little education. Oh, honey, please. Please. Please tell me that you can only speak about us if you can be better than us. And clearly, you are so insecure because we take care of your man better than you. I think I like her, like her, like her, like her. I don't know, guys. I kind of like her. I'm kind of ratchet like that. You know, I like a little, I like a sophisticated woman, but I also like a woman that's got a little hood in her. She can kind of hit a couple blocks with me and show me some things. We understand perfect English as much as we speak it. And for one, a Filipina like me, for sure, for sure, has been to more countries in the world than you. The only place you've ever been with a mind like yours is the back of your man's truck. Hold up. I am being insulted. I'm just going to defend myself, son. Go inside the room. Listen to me. Do not insult us Filipinas because you know nothing about us. All you know is that your men are picking us over you. But then again, we kind of prefer, at least women like me, prefer hard men all the damn time. Iba pa rin Pinoy. Tony, please get out. I'm trying to school this woman because she doesn't know Jack Tooth. Don't start with me, honey. I've already made a video before. If your men come to the Philippines or Thailand or any other Asian country, it's because they like Asian spice. We're spicy. We're delicious. We know how to take care of your men and ourselves. And we age well. Why do you think that is? Mm-mm. Why do you think they like us for our skin? They like us for our hospitality or they like us for the things we do that we can tell you on TikTok because we might get banned. <laughs> they have brought the hood, the alley, the gutter, the village, whatever y'all want to call it, out of these women because they not playing no more. I'm very glad to see foreign women start defending themselves and and defending passport men in the process. These women see what's going on. They've been seeing what's going on. This lady here really does sound like Ice Cube when he left NWA. God damn, I'm glad y'all set it off. Hmm. So don't start with me. Hmm? Don't make an entire case that, oh, because we're so less. That's why they like us. No, honey. No, we're not less. In fact, we're more expensive. But then we can afford ourselves. You're talking about a very small portion. A very small portion of women who need your men to live. But if you are going to speak about the general population of empowered Filipinas, honey, please. We chose your men. It's not that your men chose us because we speak little English or that we don't have education. Honey, hmm. you know I could die. Why don't you ask one of your Filipina friends to translate this? Ayaw mi glabda kay dili mo mga lami baho pag ibog ilo kung di mo kaligo kami bisan pagpila ka adlaw lami mi dili mi ninyo mapil di mo na ko ako ninyo maghilo mo ingat Mwah. I think the modern black woman has been very disrespectful towards these women a lot of these women has not been saying anything so they probably took that as a sign of weakness so they just really pounced on Asian and foreign women with their disrespectful comments. But I think they're about to be taught a lesson. These women from South Asia are about to start turning up and making some noise. Our Colombia, yes. uh, the Philippines, Thailand, yeah. like oh. women can that can speak very- Since when did English become a basis for someone's intelligence? Tell me. And if you wanna know why men from your country travel to other countries to find someone who's more caring, loving, and respectful, it's because of women like you. So, of course, they're going to hate on the winning team cheerleading squad. You guys can twerk and dance better than them, but you still lost the championship game. You still don't have the ring and you don't have the trophy. What that trophy is, is your men. You lost your men 30 to 40 years ago following American feminism standards. Now look at you. 
all right so i've been seeing a lot of videos like this one where african-american women are just so aggravated towards um passport bros and asian women because apparently um men from western countries have just decided to pack up their things fly to asia to find a wife now they have started to attack us asian women and i'm someone who comes from the philippines so I'm just really surprised because now they are calling us uneducated. They are calling us unable to speak in English. So I'm not really sure what language I'm speaking now because apparently we don't speak English here and that we just need men to rescue us. Now, you know, all those statements are wrong in so many levels. But what really disappoints me is this, you know, these African-American women, these are the ones who actually like yell and scream about discrimination and racism all their lives. But what are they doing now? I mean, practice what you preach. She's really not being hood like that. She's being classic with it. You know what I mean? She ain't cursing. She ain't getting into it. But this is how you read somebody and give them a roast. You ain't got to be so, you don't have to be like a lot of black women gave their sons. They call it a tongue lashing where they just cuss you out, go in on you, tell you you ain't nothing, your dad ain't nothing, all that, you know, but, but she's going off, but it's still kind of in a classy way. But on a serious note, though, it's a shame that these women got to even make videos like this. There's no other race of women got to make a video to rebuttal something that other hateful women are saying about them because their men are leaving. Black women dislike Asian women because they lost their men to them. They can't stop black men from leaving and being happy, and it kills them. Black women literally want to control black men's happiness. Can you believe that? Yes, you can. Because it's true. Everybody in the world knows why black men are walking away from Western women. All of them, not just black women. <laughs> but that's all I got in this video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Share this video. Like the video. Drop a comment down below. I would love to hear what you guys think about these Filipino ladies. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.